Hi, I'm Frank Rohr. I'm President and Chief Scientist for Delta Waterfowl. Delta, like most duck hunters this fall, is very concerned about the pintail problem. And the pintail problem, to be honest, is we're only allowed to harvest one pintail this fall. So we have these very restrictive regulations, and we think that they're perhaps too restrictive and don't face up to the new realities uh, for pintails. Pintails are still a relatively abundant duck, far more common than redheads, canvasbacks, black ducks, and yet for those species we can shoot two, and for pintails that are more than twice as abundant, we can only shoot one. So that doesn't make intuitive sense. Our pintail problem is driven by the fact that the goal for pintails is around four million, but pintail counts have been much less, you know, in the neighborhood of two million. We even dropped below two million a few years ago, but 2.3 million. So we're well below the target. That target was set long ago when we had better conditions. Maybe the new pintail population level is the new normal, and we should acknowledge that. So that's one of our research focuses. We've got two great scientists from, from uh, U.S. institutions, Dave Coons at Colorado State, Dr. Todd Arnold at, at uh, University of Minnesota, and they're working on different parts of this story. Dave is going to look at the carrying capacity, the habitat conditions, in, particularly in Prairie Canada. We've lo lost a lot of wetlands, and the wetlands probably just can't support a population of 4 million. So that's one aspect, to look at wetland loss and how many pintails could the wetlands in, in Prairie Canada support. And the second part is to look at actual duck production. We do that by looking at age ratios. So that's Todd Arnold's going to look at age ratios. And we can do that from the fall harvest and also at banding stations look at age ratios. And so Todd is going to assess whether production has really fallen off in association with this no-till agriculture and all this stubble. So we've got two major projects focused on important inputs to these AHM models, and we hope we can provide better data to the service to give us more realistic uh, harvest regulations that, that might increase the harvest amount for pintails. So those are the two major projects Delta is undertaking to, to help solve the pintail problem.